So we got in a massive like fight New Year's Eve, like a scream fight because we yeah. were matchless. It's packed. It's loud. I went across the street and just drank to like a less crowded bar, and that was great. But then I finished my drink. I'm like, I got to drive home here, you know? Yeah. <laughs> like, <laughs> and uh, so we got in a fight. So then, then like I, you know, it's last Saturday. I'm sick. I have to go home. I have stuff I got to do. We we're fighting. We get in this big fight. Then she's like, "Oh, it's my friend's birthday party." So then we have to go to the friend's birthday party on New Year's Eve. Uh, no, this is the last week. The next, last yeah, week, oh, another okay. another um, fight. Oh. And uh, and uh, she's like mad. And we get to the birthday party. I, I, you know, I know the girl and her husband. We're good friends with them, but I don't know anybody else. And it's loud. And I'm like, this, you know, sucks. And we're fighting. And it was one of those fights where, like, you can't. I'm like, well, you're not listening to anything I'm saying. So right, I just right. Don't want it. Engage. Yeah, we have to separate. Yeah, that means we have to completely diver- Which diverge. Which is what a things. grown up does. Yeah, yeah. You just walk away right. so you can talk later. Are there people though that can actually? I mean, you know, I've actually I've gotten good at it as of in the last few years, I guess. Yeah. But I was never one to back down from a challenge. If there was some sort of like you're not hearing me, I would I would like be so fucking overcome with the need to penetrate whatever it is that's blocking yeah. me out that I was that psycho that was like talking fast constantly at my I, girlfriend i think i think part of that's my like patrice training where i'm like these females they're too <laughs> emotional and they don't they don't listen to logic yeah but but also it's like i don't want to i don't know i don't you, you know what it's like when you're trying to get a word in and they don't they yes. don't hear you and they throw it back at you and i'm like this isn't worth it right so i i go to sleep and i put a pillow over my head and she's like yelling at me and she's like you're not even gonna say anything and i'm like no i'm going to bed she's like i can't believe i'm, I'm trying to talk to you and she, i'm like all right i'm going to sleep and uh she takes my phone and she sticks my the, my phone up my ass <laughs> Sure, it wasn't Mike. <laughs> so we go. I go to sit down uh, first off at this booth, right? Then Mike does this fun thing when you go to sit down. He tries to thumb your asshole. Uh, yeah. Like he puts like a spike strip. Yeah, it's a real. Uh, it's it's a ninth grade trick, but it's a good. Bit. It I was like really it still. infuriating. So I had to thumb my asshole. Huh? Well, I, I have like one thumb that's also shorter than the other. It's Dana, not. if you could get it's this real, on, on close it's up, awful. and then maybe screen cap this. Perfect. Uh, yeah. So this was if the Mike hammer Cannon that I just thumb my asshole. He's dying. <laughs> that's what I. So it was one of those like I that started to sit dying. and did like the wow, like you just sat on a fucking tack. He you know, puts it on. The, yeah, he puts it on the chair. Yeah, I went. Yeah. I went up as he was going down though. So this had a lot of force. So I. So that happened, right? Which I said. You went in his. I got a knuckle in there. Sure. So I. I go to the next. Uh, so fast forward a half hour. We go outside uh, in, at the stand, and we're we're smoking, and we're in the little like uh, courtyard area in the back of the stand. So we, it's me and you and Sagalo, a couple other people, whatever. Yeah. And at one couple point, other people that deal drugs specifically, so we don't necessarily yeah, want to name yeah, them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So at one point during the uh, circle, all of a sudden something hits my ass. Okay, <laughs> and I fucking. Chopped it down as hard as I could, thinking it was Mike's hand, Again, right? Yeah. So I thought it was Mike's hand. I chopped it down and was like, what the fuck? Like that? And did that. It was the one of like the kitchen workers who was picking up a mop and wasn't looking where the nub of it was going, and it went <laughs> directly into my ass. That's when you want to make your Irish goodbye. 